Hey guys, welcome back. Last time we did our first four index cards. You should have four more blank index cards in your binder. Go ahead and pull out four cards. We're gonna do the next four. Uh, these are gonna be tested things, so make sure you do a good job with this today. So on the cards, you're gonna prep the same information that we did last time. You're gonna put tuba up in the left-hand corner, and then in the right-hand corner, you're gonna put your first and your last name. You're gonna draw the five lines of the staff. Make sure you leave space below because you're a tuba, you need that. Use the blue lines on your index card to help you. Then you're gonna draw your bass clef uh, on that. I'm gonna help you with bass clef. Count up four lines, one, two, three, four. Big fat hairy dot. Draw a half a heart or a candy cane, whichever makes you happier. And then two dots, then space number four and space number three. Those are our fancy script F that's happening right there. We play connect the dots and now we are ready to go. Go ahead and pause the video, take care of setting up those first four index cards. And when you're ready, come back and hit play again and we'll get uh, the next four notes on your cards. Hey guys, welcome back. Let's put our first, our next four notes on your cards. These are going to be uh, space notes. Yesterday we did line notes. Today all of these notes are going to be on the spaces. So I am going to begin, we're going to kind of do this, um, we're going to add some ledger lines here. So you're going to need to add three lines to get us down into a register. One, two, three. And these notes, remember, are space notes. So none of them are gonna go on the line. They're going to be between the lines. Or in this case, the first note is gonna be hanging below the line. So this circle is going to go here, squishy circle. Kind of tried to get mine eyeballs there. Let me take that out. And this is the note named G. We're gonna put that on the back. We're going to get rid of on the front side we're going to do card number two card number two we're going to need three le uh, two ledger lines and we're going to hang this just below that ledger line this is the note b remember to be pausing your video anytime you need more time then we're going to get rid of another ledger line. So only one ledger line here. And this is going to be hanging below the line. And this is the note name D. And last but not least, we don't need to draw uh, an extra line for this because it's within the scope of the staff. So this is going to hang below line number one. And this is a very important note for tuba world. This is the note F. All right, so there you go. You should have now eight index cards, your first eight notes, and you will be taking a timed test on these notes. So go ahead and start practicing. Practice them on your own. Get your family members to help you.